Hey guys, Bob Conrad, tour guide here at Capricorn Sound Studios. Uh, today we're going to be discussing our isolation chamber here in Historic Studio A. Uh, our isolation chamber we use here um, to isolate any particular instrument or vocalist that we want to keep separate from the rest of the band. Uh, primarily the drums. Uh, drums are so loud that in a studio, wherever the drums are, we try to isolate other instruments or particularly vocalists. So they'll go inside here in our, into our isolation chamber where you won't be able to catch any other sound entering that space. It gives us a nice clean track to work with when, we come, uh, when it comes time to mixing. So let's go inside our isolation chamber and take a closer look. Inside our isolation chamber in here, it dampens all the sound. So in that way, when we're recording in here, we're getting a pure signal going straight to the soundboard. Whether it's a vocalist or instrumental like an acoustic guitar or something generally soft-spoken, we'll try to bring in here into our isolation booth. When we recorded with the great band Blackberry Smoke, they invited the flute player from Marshall Tucker Band, Marcus Henderson, down here. And we brought Marcus Henderson in here into our isolation booth to record his flute tracks. That way we could keep all the instruments separate from that. Uh, it's all original in here, original from the 1970s. We didn't touch or change a single thing about this. So it's still original carpet from the 70s that helps dampen the sound. Uh, and all the sound panels that surround this, uh, this isolation booth. It gives it a nice, clean, crisp sound going straight to our soundboard for best quality. All right, thanks for joining us as we walk around Capricorn Sound Studios looking at all the cool, unique features that we have here. Come on down and take a full tour. Uh, and in the meantime, check on our social media pages uh, for more cool videos like this.